Hello, here I'm gonna to tell you the summary of Harold Winter's first play, The Room. As I mentioned in my first video that uh, there are six characters. Rose Hurd, she is apparently a woman of 60 years old. She welcome all the characters that entered the room. Bart Hurd, a man of 50 years old apparently. He doesn't say a word until the last pages of the book. Mr. Keed, an old man, and he is the landlord. Mr. and uh, Mrs. Sands, a young couple uh, that want to buy a room in that very place where Bart Hurd and Rose Hurd lives. Really, a black blind man, he lives in the basement. He uh, gives to Rose a strange message, pretty weird character. And uh, the plot of the play is very simple one uh, act play. The story takes place in a room. Uh, outside there is a cold weather, snowy and windy weather. Continuous utterances of characters start with Rose and Bart alone. He is reading the newspaper and she is talking alone. Harold Winter's The Room clearly portrays a lack of communication among the characters of the play, which refers to the condition of modern man. This failure of communication led Harold Winter to use a lot of pauses and uh, silences in all the plays he wrote instead of words. Samuel Beckett preceded Winter in doing so in his plays since both uh, them belong to the absurd theater and one way to express the bewilderment of modern man during the 20th century is through the use of no language in the dramatic works language is more important to modern man instead he uses silence to express his feelings Silence is more powerful than words themselves. That is why long and short pauses can be seen throughout all Pinter's play. As you uh, know that uh, his style known as Pinter's. Uh, here is a summary. Rose occupies a single room in a large house with her husband afferent Bart. While preparing Bart's meal in Preparation for his drive, Rose nervously talks uh, on about the hazardous weather, the damn danger of the basement, and how happy and undisturbed they are in their room. Throughout which Bart, silently indifferent, reads his paper, eats his meal, and sips his uh, tea. Even when the landlord, Mr. Keed, shows up unannounced to ramble on about sundry topics, Rose remains curiously an, on edge, fearful of uh, some imminent event, and Bart keeps aloof, as if he were the only inhabitant uh, in the room. After Bart leaves for his drive, Rose now alone appears to go through the motion of attempting uh, to tame the unpredictable uh, capriciousness of life through the mundanity of ritualistic domestic tasks. For example, uh, rearranging the furniture thus versus arranging it thus, a silent meditation on the pathetic fragility of the safety and comfort of our little worlds that we endeavor to fortify against the wantonness of life's vicissitudes. Uh, the compostability of Rose's rooms is continually assaulted, however, first by the imposingly intrusive Mr. Sand and Mrs. Sands. Uh, just notice their surname sands they are the sands of time okay 
two orderly menacing characters that seem directed straight a uh, nail came and novel and then again by mr kid who this time begs and then threatens also rose to receive the mysterious man in the basement who claims he knows her reluctantly rose agrees to meet the stranger relay and after some strange uh, intonation regarding her father's wishes rose gradually wants to him and even appear to approach some profound and peaceful enlightenment regarding her fate but once bart returns home from his drive uh, revive fight and now oddly he is talkative bart is now talkative uh, whatever he was in past time rose's new found composer is rendered insecure once more by the unpredictable menace of violence here you may apply uh, rose's house much like uh, is isn't it like a cave if yes if you say that yeah it may be then you also apply the theory of pope's cave here okay so rose doesn't know anything beyond his room she is safety in her room she doesn't want to be acquainted in the world of outside so here was a, a synopsis of the play here that's enough for today more uh, you will get in my upcoming videos have a great time thank you